I would like first to say that this year, 2015, is the 40th anniversary of INTA. We found a document, a legal document, that the association has been declared in 1975 by uh, Michel Baucher, at, at the time chairman of a uh, parliamentary commission, who has created INTA the same year. So fantastic. So let's, uh, let's celebrate the 40th anniversary of our association. Very good. Thank you. We, we are, okay, we are a network of multiple experiences, that, that I said. We have principles and the approaches that we are uh, differing. It's uh, innovation, innovation, political responsibility, and partnership. These are the three key words that we are using those days. Uh, it's very important to understand that innovation process, and we will see it uh, later today and uh, particularly tomorrow afternoon uh, with the uh, uh, initiative on uh, Ash uh, Habitat 3. Uh, therefore, the cloud of INTA is represented by this uh, cloud of words, concepts, uh, actions. Uh, we are action-oriented, and we count on you to enrich the listing of the words and to show that we are more than just this uh, dozen of uh, words, but certainly we are. Uh, we do value international cooperation. We have members in nearly 100, low, lower than 100 countries, uh, thousand members and all these people around the world and the fact that you are here today is evidence that we are truly international. We have delegation from Latin America, from United States, from Africa, from Europe. For the first time in our history we don't have Asian delegation. Oh, I should say Indonesia is coming. How pre former President Budiarsa is coming but his plane is late and it will be in, in a couple of hours it will be uh, but due to political circumstances in Asia, there are plenty of elections. The Taiwanese cannot come, and the, the others cannot come. So we are missing uh, our Asian friends. But we are international. International because this is the map. This is the map of the members in the world. As you can see, we have representation in a large number of countries, well spread uh, around the world. It is true members in true, in true countries, and we can provide you the addresses of all the people we are listed here. What is also interesting is the places where INTA has been active in the past uh, 40 years, let's say. And we, you see, we are not only, we are not European centered, we are truly international in the sense that our, our actions took place in those different, uh, in the different areas. And uh, of course, Russia is so big that we have done nothing so far. United States, we were born out of the States, but we have not, oh yes, we had an, yeah, sorry, we should, we, we did something in, Calif in, Fro in Florida, we should have put it, and Canada, unfortunately, we have no action yet in Canada. Uh, on, uh, in Europe only, this is the places where we have been active over the last uh, 15 years, in terms of either panels, seminars, conferences, uh, special, uh, specialties. So, we have a proper good coverage of uh, European issues and we have pretty, pretty good knowledge of uh, the uh, European networks. So we are engaging uh, our partners into uh, sharing their experience, sharing their know-how and practices and value their comments and, and support. I usually said that INTA is knowledge, know-how and making know making known in the sense in French is savoir faire savoir savoir faire uh, in a sense that we want to communicate also on what we are doing. Main activities, uh, main, main activities in, uh, in, in this year. Over 800 participants were gathered in, uh, uh, no, sir, what's happened? Back, yes. We are gathered in 18 events in 10 different countries despite the difficulties, the crisis, and a, the current political crisis, we had a large number of people that we were able to gather and to share with them their expertise and experiences. Now, basically what we have done this year, we covered integrated, police, integrated public policy in a sense that we have addressed a social issue, very, very, very intri intriguing social issue, in the relationship between sport and handicap and urbanization and we're working with the county council nearby Paris 
on the, the creation of an establishment of a technological social sports center dedicated to handicapped people, uh, which is a quite very interesting uh, project that we are on. The city back to the citizen, this is the topic of the, of the Congress. And it was also an issue that has been addressed at MIPIM in Cannes under the think tank mayor, and we are one of the animators of the think tank mayor of MIPIM, which is 80 mayors gathered for half a day discussing uh, critical issues for them, and that ran for several years and years. Urban innovation, as I said, our main, main stream of activities is on uh, innovation. Innovation expressed through the initiative we took for Habitat 3, that will be discussed extensively uh, Wednesday afternoon. We work on smart cities and we had a, a lot of meetings, uh, smart cities policy in Lisbon in particular, we had in Taipei and the smart city forum organized by our partner La Tribune that took place in Santander, in Spain, in Bordeaux, in Marseille, in France and we are partner of the program and we do contribute to, um, to the issues. We, you may remember that we proposed to launch an enterprise. The price is officially launched today in cooperation with the newspaper Le Monde. We, Le Monde and us, plus some industrial sponsors, agreed to launch a prize which is called Price for Urban Innovation. Price Le Monde Inta for Urban Innovation. And that was decided last week. The announcement was made by the journal Le Monde, and we are making the announcement today that this price is open. The criteria for a submitting an entry to the price will be available by mid-December and by mid-January. You will receive information, and that price is open to the world, and it will be well uh, documented and well supported by the newspaper. We are very proud that they came to us and they asked us to do it, and uh, we uh, got, got there. Urban smart regeneration was also a topic that we addressed this year, particularly the, the relationship between heritage and smart uh, development, smart city development and heritage. And that took place at the MIPIM in Tokyo uh, with a, quite a sizable number of participants and uh, presentations. And it, it will be certainly repeated next year, so some of you will be invited to go there. Metropolisation. We are working on metropolisation, which is the metropolitan process. We are going to discuss that this afternoon with Yap Moder in, the, in this afternoon session. But also we have a commission from the Caisse Depot, which is the National Loan and Saving Banks, and a commission from the City Hall of Paris to organize something related to metropolisation process beginning of 2016. We have postponed a number of uh, we have been delayed from due, due to circumstances that you can understand. Territorial development. Uh, yes, still the strong, the strong body of knowledge uh, of INTA. Uh, governance of a large project. We just returned and some of the members in the room participated to an, a, a panel in, uh, on the island of La Réunion in Indian Ocean on the, the management of a very large project, 5,000 hectares. 100,000 inhabitants for the next 20 years, let's say, and we advised, second time we advised them, but we advised them then on the institutional montage, the institutional framework under on, on which uh, the, product, the, the project can be, can be run. Contrat de réciprocité. It is a, an idea of territorial development, and as I said, by extending the geographical perimeter of INTA to uh, peri-urban and rural areas. Provence Verte is a community of small villages, small towns, not exceeding 2,000, 3,000 inhabitants uh, between Aix-en-Provence, Marseille, and Toulon. And we are working with this community to, uh, to identify potential partnership between metropolitan area and rural areas. And we are working uh, with uh, planning agencies from Toulon, Marseille, and Grenoble and putting a, pro a program that should be supported by the central government. And the minister, Madame Le Branchu, this afternoon, will certainly make references uh, to this uh, contrat de réciprocité. We worked also uh, under contract from the French development agency, AFD. Uh, we, win. we won uh, two bids 
two, 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 bid, two international bids with funds from the European Investment Bank, the uh, European Union, and uh, on the uh, restructuring of the center of Aqaba in Jordan and restructuring the center of Jericho in uh, Palestine. And uh, a team from INTA was selected and sent there, and already they are producing uh, the report. We just submitted an application to work on the city of Alexandria in Egypt, which is a follow-up of uh, some activities we had last year, and we are applying to the bid. And we don't know if we will be winning. We will know that next week, but it is part of the same center uh, focus of interest of the association. And then we should not forget that in 2015, we had the 38 congresses took place in Tallinn, and that was a great congresses with a lot of participants, a very warm atmosphere. And uh, our friends from Tallinn cannot come because this is their voting the budget, uh, the city budget, just this week. So the mayor and his team cannot, cannot come, but they send their best regard and success to the conference. I don't want to take more time to present you what INTA is. I would just recommend you to, uh, you have a leaflet, or you should have a leaflet in your bag of what is INTA. So please do read that. It takes two minutes to read, to see the leaflets. And this is a list of all the activities of the year. But you will find all these activities on our website. If you consult the website, you will see the detail, the illustrations, the name, the reporting of these activities. As you can see, we work every, every month. There is at least one or two activities that the association is carrying for the benefit of the members, not for us, it's for you that we work. And we hope to continue next year, and I wish you an excellent 38, 39 Congress. Thank you. Thank you very much.